Yeah. And you know it's good for cancer cell too. And burying it under the ground for nine days. Uh -huh. Dig it up back when you you can't open it, man. If you open it, you <laughs> Hey guys, well, I see here again from my islandjamaica.com. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to my series on interesting Jamaican fruits. Today we feature the mountain sap. Not sour sap, mountain sap. And no one is more qualified than my virgin. Life, Rastaman, Rootsman, to share all this experience and information on this fruit. First, though, a big shout out to all of you, those persons who have been asking for me to do different type of fruits shout out to you and for those who have been asking about mountain sap in particular shout out special shout out to you if you though if you you if you are brand new here meaning you haven't subscribed to my channel i invite you to join us and hit that subscribe button and tap the bell notification i do a lot of videos talking about the real jamaica this though is a series on fruit when i do a wide range of videos on jamaica i call it the real jamaica you don't want to miss this out so Join us, man. If you have not yet subscribed, hit that subscribe button and tap the bell notification, and that way you'll see updated on all my latest videos. Let's go. So, guys, this is Mr. Clive. He's gonna show us, we're gonna learn about the mountain sap. Another intriguing, interesting fruit here in Jamaica. And I'm at the back of his house, and we're gonna trot along. Cool area here, Mr. Yeah. Yeah, don't fall though. Take it down. Yeah, man. Have a, oh, oh, this, a, this looks like it's a mountain up on the ground here. So we're, yes, we're close, man. Yeah. All right, guys. That's, that's one there. So we are close, close, close. It appears. What is this, Mr. Before we? Yeah. What is this? This looks like. This a, is a fruit. Is yes, this a sidium? Yes. Ah. Yes. We can this, use them make juice. This. Cherry. This is the Sidium. I actually did a feature on that. Guys, you remember this one? Some of you should remember this one. This maca tree we talk about with um, Mr. Ferguson, the, the, uh, the Rasta man. But there's nothing on here, on here right now. No, no, no. Uh, it doesn't come yet. Okay. Time it beering. All right. But if you're interested. One yeah, man. This is, this, is, this is. I didn't know we have a lot of them in, up the, in, in Jamaica here. But now you're. It is your tree now is suggesting to me that other people. It's not just Mr. Ferguson and a few other people have it. Yeah. There might be other people who have it, man. All right, guys. So this is the Sidium again. If you didn't watch that video, check a link. There's a link in the description. Check it out to learn more about the amazing health benefits. There's another one here. Yes. And that one is a June plum. And this is a June plum. All right. Yeah. All right. Getting a little windy. We're going up a little hill, <laughs> guys. This one is the end. Um, and it makes mountains up. A mountain sap. Mountain sap too, okay. but it falls. All right, so good. So that's why you lean like this. All right, all right. So yeah. this this mountain sap is still on the ground here. But the one who, the one we want to feature is this, this one. one. This one is the big one that has the fruit on it. This if one. If you look carefully, there's a fruit right there. Ah, there's a fruit. All See? right, that's it, that's it. Okay, the mountain sap. All right, so hold on a second. Is this one tree, mister? Yes, this one, like, one tree. You sure? You look like, wood. Look, if you look, look like two to me. If, no, no, no. If you look where you're coming from. Mm -hmm. This is okay, okay. See, okay, cool. Okay, cool. So you come from rear on the back uh -huh. there. It's just one, but it put on different kind limb. Of limb. All yeah. right. You see, this all this one is the younger one that it come from. This is it. Yeah. Alright, let's start with this one. Let's start yeah. with this one. So this is the baby one. This is like this the flower. Is right, right, all right, right. That's so where it comes and open. Mm -hmm. You get the fruit come from inside like this. Uh-huh. Alright. So how yeah. long how long typically? It takes to come? Yeah. Well, main city about like six, seven months. From to, from this, yes, to fruit, to, to fruit, to, okay, to get it so you can work with it, yeah, to make your juice and stuff seven like months, that. yes, okay. And there's a, is there a season for it this uh, time? At this time, which is those who might be watching uh, the replay, uh, tell like say so you could get it start get it from August coming down to now, August to September, uh, yeah. October ish. Yeah. But you see like where the rain is falling now. Uh -huh. They just they fell out. Uh-huh. You see Okay, the sap. Oh. Yeah, yeah. The, the okay. Water. Yeah, we saw one earlier. Look like this. Oh, okay. So that's mm -hmm. that's one that's falling and spoiling. Yeah, yeah, they chew the water now. Oh, it's kinda rainy, understand. rainy. Understand. See a tree over there to where, uh -huh. where it's spoiling. Okay, that one's spoiling. Yeah. Uh -huh. And if I don't visit it. Uh -huh. Regularly, uh -huh. you know, it to like that. But you see, you see the one there, uh -huh. and then up at the top, we have more. Two more. All right, so yeah. tell us about the tree fire. 
Three the three how all right typically how so somebody watching right now and don't want to get an idea of the tree what it i mean how tall yeah it, you go real tall man uh -huh. yeah and so, sometimes they get real big like so mm -hmm. big big fruit yeah that means come. like like two three See, two three pounds about four pounds five oh. pounds one of them get uh -huh. round and big uh-huh yeah okay all right so we're gonna take a look at one of the fruit guy Ah, uh, it's man. <laughs> <laughs> no, hold on, no climbing, I'm not here. Ah, uh, okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. All right, all right, guys. Fireman I jump, but him not reach it, so guess what? He's going to climb it and push it down. And then me try and hold on to it. Okay, I think we have it, man. Hold on, man. Hold on. Let's do it. Take your time. Don't oh, you shake off one fireman. <laughs> Take your time, take your time. Don't shake it too much, you know, man. We don't want to shake her. Uh, all right. Okay. Yeah, man, we will it, man. So this is the mountain sap, the mystery fruit. Another mystery fruit here, guys, in Jamaica. Mountain sap. I think... I'm, well, go ahead and pick it, Mr. Mr. Clive, and then we talk, talk a little bit more about it. <laughs> all right, good. All right, good, so... Pick it. Make yes, it man, simple. go ahead and pick it, man. All right. So tell us now... Tell us that this one is about... Uh, it's about like half a pound. Yeah, re re musically, yeah. Uh huh. And this when guys, can you judge it based on based on the size of my hand? And it's coming full to you. See where it start to burst. Uh huh. Yeah. The, oh, when it start to burst, it, I mm, mean, it's ready. Yeah, yeah. You see okay. That? Yeah. So this is you'd say a relatively small one. This. Yes. Relatively. Right. Compared to what come on it already. Okay. All yeah. right. So, and this looks all right for those of you who know sour sap. Yeah, it's like almost a family, but it's have a different yeah. juice from the sour sap. Yes, it, the yeah. outside look a little uh, faintly like it. Yeah, the, 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 the prickle stuff. Yeah, that's the way mucker come from. Yes, yeah. yes. Mm -hmm. So it's like the sour sap, but it's a family of sour sap, but Be it's basic, total. Yeah. But it's a different in a lot of ways. Yeah, right. All right. And it give you a different juice from a sour sap. Too. Uh huh. The, the, the texture, the skin, and so on feels just like the sauce up for the most part, though, right? Mm -hmm. Right? And uh, looks the same, and as, as I mentioned, all this spiky stuff there, just like the sauce up. But the difference between this and the sauce up mainly is that it's round. Yes, sauce so up come along long yeah. sometimes. Yeah. Yeah, don't different basically run. Like but this one is mainly round. Yes. All right, so yes. before we talk about how you use it, I want to talk about the, uh, what the other difference is there between this and the sour sap as far as you the know. The juice, the juice from the sour sap uh -huh. have a whitish look. Uh -huh. And this one from the mountain sap uh -huh. have a kind of little browner, uh -huh. browner look, you mm -hmm. know. Mm -hmm. So you have it differently. Yes, okay. When you juice it, uh -huh. you get a different juice from what you get from a sour sap. Okay. A sour sap gives you a thick juice, uh -huh. but this one gives you a thick same way, but it have a different taste. Okay. What, what the, how does it taste? It have a like... A, let me see now. Almost like a guava. Guava taste. Guava taste. Okay, like, okay, you know? okay. That's how you do it. They're totally different. Yes. So those are yeah. the would be the main differences between a yeah. sauce. Yeah. What about yeah. you? I, I'm, and, and I'm talking, I'm asking the questions, guys, for you, because I know about it a little bit. It's an unusual fruit. I ran into it yes. via my brother a couple of years ago. But for many of you, this is the very first time you're seeing. So that's why I'm asking him the question to help you. The texture. Yeah. yeah. The texture. It is a little bit more... Slimy, yes. More thicker, thicker, thicker too. Yeah. <laughs> more than a sour sap. Yes, it's very thick, and yeah. you can use less to get from, more from it. Yes, yes. That's sure. the difference between. Yeah, yeah. So for those who might be asking, what's the difference between the mountain sap and the sour sap? Those are the main differences. Yeah. All right. How do you use it, fire? Well, when I use it, uh -huh. I use like you know the guava. Guava, yeah, regular guava. guava. Yes, uh -huh. I get the guava juice, uh -huh. and then I add it to the mountain sap. Oh. So, so, so you, you take out it, but there are seeds in the mountain sap, right? Yes, but okay. this mountain sap juice, you don't have to squeeze the seed. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You can use the mountain sap alone and make a juice too, you know. Uh -huh. But when I use it with this... The How guava, you use Yeah, man, that's understandable. How yeah, you use it, yeah. Yeah, I use it with the guava and you get a nice juice same way. More, okay. more even more with different potent, uh -huh. you know, yes. and value yes, to yes. put with the mountain sap. All right, so yeah. here what happened now. We're gonna, and that's a lot how, of people don't know that. That's how you use it. So, yeah. so, so we're gonna we're gonna do a couple things. One, 
we're gonna bust it open and show show everybody what is inside it how it looks this is a green one this is not yeah, ripe, right yes no oh, it's first it's of all hold on guys the green, riper so, one is better yeah we're gonna use the riper one somebody's yeah. asking what is that in your mouth and i'm, I'm telling them that's cayenne pepper <laughs> <laughs> that's cayenne pepper <laughs> That's cayenne pepper. Yeah. Guy. Now, he doesn't eat it like that. No. Well, what's, is, is that the name of it? Cayenne pepper, right? Yes. Uh, uh, bird yeah. pepper. Bird pepper. You call it bird pepper. Too. Okay. Yeah. But we, did, we give it the name, what we give it is the cayenne pepper. Yes. And they have a next pepper to where they can cayenne to, but it's longer and yeah. more bigger. Yeah. You know? Yeah. But this is my medicine. Yes. My cayenne pepper. I yeah. use it to chew my food. Yeah. Cook with. Uh -huh. And uh, that's what I use. <laughs> yeah, all right. Yeah, all right. So and I drink some too yeah. to clean my inside and coal and all of that. All right. And yeah. the fireman have that too. So <laughs> anyway, I thought I thought you were gonna ask about that, guys. So that I just I just put that in as a side note. So let's let's um burst that open fire. This. Well, actually, this, let's do both. Green. You want me to burst this? Well, let's you can well let's burst it if you want. Yeah, we, well, let's do both. We're gonna burst the green one and burst it, and burst the ripe one. All right, so we don't normally do this. We don't normally do this, guy. But we, we usually do the ripe one. But we wanted to give you a, give you a, a perspective as well. This is a green one. Yeah. And this one, it looks. You said yeah, the color was a little different from sauce. Yes. It's yeah, a little bit more creamier, yellowish, yellowish, yellowish yes, color. Yes, okay. Yes. And it has just about the same amount of seed. Yeah, a lot more. More seed than sauce. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. But that's how it look. Yeah. This is when it's. When it's before green. it's dry, just before it's, it's mature. Yes, oh, yes, all right, yes. good, good. But you can't use it before. You don't use it before. It's no, dry. no, no, no. It's not no, like no, you can no, cook no, with it or yeah, yeah. Typically, you just juice, just mm -hmm. juice. You wrap it and juice it. And you know, it's good for cancer cell too. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mountain sap. All right. Even sour sap. Too. Yeah, man. Yeah. I heard. Of, I know about the sour sap. Yes. Uh, it's very potent. Yes. Very yes, potent. Yes. Yes. All right. Good. So that's the inside of the mature one, but not ripe. Let's take a look at the ripe one, guys. Okay. So on a side note here. Guys, uh, Rastaman is telling me that. Tell me about the leaves. So tell me about the leaves. The leaves, you can use the leaf and drink it. Same uh. way like the sour sub. Uh -huh. And you get this still good for the cancer cell too. Same value? Yes. Okay. Yes, yes. So how you use the leaves? You have to dry it. Like uh. you pick it about like three, four days after the full moon. Uh -huh. After the full moon? Uh, yes. Uh -huh. And then you put it not in the sun, in a cool place. Uh -huh. And then you draw that and sip it like a tea in the morning time. Uh -huh. And it's how many how many leaves and how many More like say about four or five leaves uh -huh. per you cup know? yes okay right. so that and would be a very strong one not too strong okay no dry okay yeah. and you put once it in you the... put it in the cool place uh -huh. don't dry it dry it crystallize it yes. put it in cool place yes, yes. and then it stay there uh -huh. and then you take it and you draw a cup of tea with that and uh -huh. drink it like how often do you drink the tea you can drink it like about three four five times for the week or yeah. so and then you ease off for our next time and yeah. how much time per day one or twice one time one cup okay in the one morning. Time. okay like you get up on your field yeah yeah and you want a cup of tea yeah you just draw one cup of tea like this and yeah. you drink it Tip yeah. in, in fact you typically can put a little piece of simian leaf inside of it too uh -huh, uh -huh. and give it a flavor all right but me you know when me do this tea me don't sweeten it me drink it just like that just like that no sweetening uh-huh yeah. all right cool yeah, yeah. All right. Sometimes you don't have to have too much sweet in the system. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Less is best, best when it comes to yeah, sweet. sweetness. All right, good. Sugar. So that's the leaves. All right, so let's go inside. Let's go around the front of the house now and check out some, some ripe one. Yeah. The mountain sap, guys. Yeah. Another interesting fruit here in Jamaica land we love. All right, hold on fire, hold on fire, hold on fire. What is this? What is this? You, what is this fruit? What is this tree? This one is Chinese guinea. Oh. Chinese guinea. You ever heard of is it? This, is this a um? It's bear fruit. Honey. Is this a lychee? Yeah. Not a lychee. No man, not lychee. It's different from the. Yeah, see, see, Chinese guinea is different. See, there, there's a tree over. All right, you see that pear tree there? Uh huh. And you pass it, you see the one with the white skin? Uh huh. That have the, the fruit on it right now. The Chinese guinea? Mm hmm. Oh, we have put to put it way up the top. We're gonna have to check it out, man. Mm -hmm. Hold on. <laughs> we might do two videos here. Uh -huh. <laughs> all right, all right. All right, guys. So we came for. Mountain sap, but the fireman is is introducing me to more stuff here. So let's see, let's see. Let me give me a thumbs up. Give me a give me a, a give me a confirmation if you want us to do that as well. So this is the Chinese guinea. Yeah, yeah. Okay. But this is a younger. This is a younger one. Okay. Mm -hmm. I have some interesting stuff. All right, good. So as you can see, guys, this Mister Turklight here have a lot of interesting fruits and stuff going on here. This is his. His his his, his his yeah his farm little farm area, all kind of stuff some here. Of it, some of it. Some of, you have more. Yes. Breadfruit, 
June plum, yeah. cherry. That's orange over there. Yeah, this one you call so it. orange. Bitter and sweet. Bitter and sweet. Mm -hmm. Okay. Trumpet the, leaf here, sir. Banana. Uh, coconut. Oh, really? Yes, man. To keep put away the corona. Okay. Yeah, oh, yeah, the vitamin C. The, yes. Okay. So you make a money off of that, then, man. Me don't make no money. <laughs> just when I heat them. Too, okay, I'm okay. Take it, go get people too, you know. Yeah, yeah, I understand. And sometimes I you know, sell everything. You know? Yeah, man, I understand. This one you call it honey banana. Honey banana. Call it call it call it and just okay. It up yes, man. No man, no trouble, man. No, no trouble. Just show you this. Nice, this, this, nice, this, this, nice. This food, I mean. Well, I tell you, we don't live some life in any country, you know. <laughs> <laughs> nice life, you know. You can live it, but if you put things to use to get it, yes, yes, it. yes. Because some people don't want to grow nothing. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody don't want to hand go out <laughs> yeah. there. Unless they fall down. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> okay, cool. <laughs> All right, cool. Nice, nice. So you go and hold him up till he's ready? Yeah, right. All right. right. And then you cut him on. Yes, man. Nice. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's yeah. a cocoa. Cocoa. Cocoa, yes. Cocoa yeah. here. Who remember cocoa? Who remember cocoa? <laughs> Come up. Drop that, drop that, make mention that in the comments. <laughs> you take it and make sick, man. Why that the cocoa? Soup is sick. The cocoa? Cook it, yes. Oh. Me no, me no eat meat, you know, like that. Oh. No, so I'm a meat, me no eat. No flesh. Mm. No, sir. Since, oh, since when? About 45 years now, me no touch no meat. 45? Yeah, I'm mean, 75. Oh, yeah, sir. Me no ask to say nothing to me, I tell you. Yeah, 75? Yeah. Me, I'm sir. I'm going to see him up there asking. Yeah, go on, good man. <laughs> <laughs> 45 years, you know, so tell me fire, hold on a second, mm -hmm. this, is, this is interesting, my people watching want to learn more about that because a lot of people want to live, want to, um, want to be healthier. Yes, but you are how do you, to do it. How do you do that, man? How do you, how, how, how you do that? How you, so we, how you substitute, how you substitute for the meat? For the meat? All right, me, me, me show you one seat, me show you again. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this is interesting, it's an interesting tour here, guys. Interesting tour here. Uh-huh. And me have two little bees I have right there, so. Uh-huh. You see the bees that fly right there? Yes, I see the bees box. Yes. Uh-huh. And, and them they something them use for honey. This oh. is bush cabbage. Yeah. Different from the falling cabbage. This yes. don't fall none at all. Yes, yes, yes. 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 Uh -huh. And this is what I make my food out of. Really? Really, regularly. See all the bud pepper You see me not me not destroy them, you know. Uh -huh. Me have them and use them too. Uh -huh. You see? Me not eat no flesh, baby. So this is mostly what we so what you mean? I mean, you mean? Uh -huh. Yeah, I mean eat like greens, uh -huh. falling cabbage too. Uh -huh. But this cabbage don't fall. Yeah. From me, they come from me old grandmother days. Yeah, yeah. They've been eating this cabbage. Yeah. It's a more potent in it. Yeah, yeah. More even the falling one. Yeah, yeah. Because the falling one is what they make. Develop in a right. lab. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So but this is like, a real bush cabbage. This bush. And bush. they say it. And this me. And look at the man face, man. I'm <laughs> almost 80 year old, man. Look. <laughs> <laughs> a firm and stern, I go time in spring. Work, me work hard too, man. Okay. Do, you see all the hillside there? Yeah. And me chop them down and feed me goat, man, and cool, things cool. like that. Cool, yeah. cool, cool, yeah. cool, 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 cool. Yeah. All right, nice, man. Proud of you, man. Proud of you. Yeah. I forget some of your recipe, let me know. Come on. <laughs> more I live long and healthy <laughs> looking like you, know. Already, man. I better, <laughs> all right, all right. All right, guys, <laughs> so going, in back and going back to the house now to you know, take a look at the ripe the mountain top. Huh? Custard apple. Custard apple, yeah, yeah. Yeah, custard apple tree this. All right, yeah, cool, cool. Nice yes, 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 man. It's one of everything. Like so uh -huh. mm -hmm. All right, cool. This is mean I'm a packet of juice. This, you know, mm -hmm. this I make from the seed bush cabbage, uh -huh. Spanish negro leaf. Yes, yes, yes. Green juice. Uh -huh. Cucumber, string bean, uh, pumpkin seed, uh -huh. and they have one, one, me have one bush there, so we then call name comfrey. Uh -huh. You know comfrey? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I heard about it. I don't remember what it looked like. Okay, but well, let me show you. You're going to show me. Yeah. So you, 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 you make that green juice green now? Green juice, with all right. And you drink, you drink that? Yes, good drink. How oh, often do you drink that? Regularly, sometime, man. You see this too? Uh -huh. You see Spanish needle. Yeah, man, that's a Spanish needle. Bad like yours, you know. I put this in it. <sighs> and leaf of life. Yeah. Jack in the bush. Yeah. That's all, that's what I use. I yeah. make juice yeah. and drink. Yeah. You know? And Clean you your system. Yeah. Good for the colon. Yes. Yeah. Cool. Um, There's a cleanser. Uh, yes. Okay. Yes. Cool. See the dandelion tree here. All the male part I me use. So make and dandelion. Go yes. Me tell you, well. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Wait, hold well, on. That's the flower. That's not the. You the, use the that too? leaf. The leaf. You use the, the leaf, leaf too. The leaf. The leaf. The leaf. Oh. And blend it out and oh. make juice from it. 
Yeah. Fire, how you learn about them something? Uh, boy, I'm creation learn me things, man. Me, me create enough little things within myself. Yeah, yeah. You know? Uh -huh. Go about the whole of uh, folks used to use all these things. Uh -huh. And drink and rub it. You know, rub it when he eat the Spanish eagle. Yeah. And jump like a brrr, and he's gone like yeah. that. Yeah, I know. I know the you know, Spanish eagle is a rabbit food. Yes, man. And it's good for me too. Yeah. See, see they come through me, I show you. Yeah. yeah. I come through through this. Oh. This come like, free! Come free. Me use oh, no, this and make, 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 make juice with this too. Cool. You see it? Yeah, this, yeah. you have a smell, right? Not much. Not really? You can't smell it, but no. Oh, no, nothing yeah. much. Okay. okay. You see this fruit now? Uh -huh. This is a fruit. But then is it a fruit or a... Egg fruit. Oh, something else? Yes, <laughs> yeah, egg have, fruit. You man have everything here, man. You mu okay, yeah, okay, okay, okay. Egg fruit. I, I buy it in the market uh -huh. from a lady, uh -huh. the fruit, uh -huh. and then I use it, blend, make juice, and then I create a plant from the seed. From the seed? Yeah. And I cool, have it right cool. There. So you have the comfrey? Yeah. What is this? This is the comfrey. Uh -huh. and, and this is this, the... This one is the egg fruit. Yeah. Guys, all right. Well, you may want to pause a little bit for asking if you pick up the rest, all right? No? <laughs> Big him up right now. Give him a thumbs up. Uh, Shira, come and say something to him now, man. This man full of knowledge. We haven't even touched the, finished the, 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 um, the mountain stop. And the man is introducing us to a whole range of other amazing stuff here. Health, uh, pear tree and all of that. See, pear yeah. up on tree there. And then man. time and then ready, you can come in. Yeah, pear, pear, pear. Somebody jealous right now, you know, man. Gungo Somebody peas, jealous. Gungo peas, gungo peas. Yeah, pear. So yeah. All of this is peas. All of this is totally organic, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. There's another fruit. This, like this one is berry. nesberry. Yeah, nesberry. Yeah, okay, cool. Papaya. I just plant some since morning. Too. Okay, cool, mm -hmm. cool, cool. This one is mint. Mm -hmm. This one is black mint. Black, black mint. Yeah. Black mint. Yeah, and this one is calic mint. Uh -huh. Yeah, well, I know the calic mint. I have, yeah. I have it at home. Right. Okay, yeah. cool, cool, so, cool. Yeah. All right, papaya over here. <laughs> uh, guys, the papaya tree here. <laughs> him, 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 him. You have all the little stuff here by himself, for himself. <laughs> Jaja. All right, so let's. um this let's is lemon, but it's not there in Lemon. Anyway. Okay, cool, cool. This All right. It's mint. You know, mint. Yeah. <laughs> mint. Yeah, yeah man. man. Remember the mint. Peppermint. The peppermint. Right. Nothing yeah. nice. No, no tea no nice like this. I'm mint, you know. Yeah. This guy. Yeah. Remember this yeah. here? Mm. Mint, man. Mint. Mm. Smell it. Smell it. I'm going to put it here closer. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> this mint here, man. It yeah. smells strong. Mm. Rice peas. Tree. Rice peas. You already forget peas. Is this, that, is this like a Jerusalem peas? Mm -hmm. You say one yeah, yeah, the one in Okay. Fine, cool. Fine, fine. 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 Okay, cool. Sure. All right, so we're back at the house. And we're going to look at the ripe mountain sap. After all of that, guys, we're back at the house. We're back at the house. So we, were, we went to the, into the, into the, the, the field, yeah, yes, the farm, right, yes, to show you. Yeah, to show you. Not much, but it's No, man, good. it's a lot. It's a lot. It's a lot. <laughs> so, somebody, somebody is impressed right now online. <laughs> all right. So, so, so again, this is, this is Clive, Rastaman Clive. And I wanted to show you the ripe mountain, mountain sap. sap. And I'm having like a calabash. Calabash. Right? This one big man. Yes, calabash. How oh, you find the one here? Yeah? Bush man. Bush man. <laughs> and I eat out of them too. Yeah, man. Show you one of them. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully you don't eat out of the one here. This is how I eat meat out of you know? Fire, this is too big man. Where you going? I see you. 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 Are you Billis? Yes. I am, we put it at the bottom here. Yeah. We put a piece of the coconut. Oh, hooks, the coconut hook. Okay. And then we use glue. Uh -huh. And get it together. Man, make him one dish. Mm, I'm in one fork. Well, I'm a second. Well, I'm a second. Hey, guys, look at this. This is the cake, man. So you have the fork and one end of the spoon. And the spoon, spoon right. Ah. And you put me near me. Ah, church. Man, you're bad. It's a maho. <laughs> you're bad like yours, man. No, this one is ironwood. Okay, ironwood. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Man. You know, you don't, you don't need to go in on supermarket, man. <laughs> but they're not too regular. You need, need, need to create enough little things for right. yourself. Well, you need to eat a lot because you work hard, so yeah, you yourself you. with that. But yeah. not try that one a little bit too big for you. <laughs> yes, no, that one. You know, if you eat too much of this, you're not going to move. Problem. I can't move. Mm -hmm. All right. So, All right, this, this, so we have five know. of them. Five of them now, right? Yes, yes. Five of them. All right, and. So you see the one where we did see with burst. Mm -hmm. So see the inside like this one. Uh -huh. So this yellow it gets. Yeah, hold it steady there for me for your hair second. Uh huh. So this is okay. So this is the, good. It gets really yellow, man. Right. How, how does it right. taste? How does it taste for you? In in no taste no. Yeah, it tastes nice. You yeah. want to taste it? 
Um, are you afraid of it? No, man, no, me, I had it already, you know. I had oh, it, oh, okay, I had it already, okay, okay. but I don't quite remember. Yeah, man, I know it, it's, it's fixed. Fresh. Fresh. It's fresh. You okay. need a bit fresher than this hour. Okay, so. okay. So I'm still it, taste it, man. Give me, give me, give me. Give me no problem, no problem, no problem, no problem. <laughs> So you can eat, you can eat it just like the sauce. Same way like the sauce. Ah. It's only a little different with the freshness. All right, good, good. It's not as sweet as the sauce. Mm, right, right, right. That's it. Okay, cool. <sighs> All right, so a little bit warm here. Warm here, even though this area is very cool, but the sun is pointing directly on us, guys. So it's not as sweet as the sauce. So. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Fresh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But it still have that kind of sauce up taste. A little bit. A little bit. That's why I call yeah. mountain sap. Mm -hmm. But typically people don't. They don't want to eat it like that. Because that. it's fresh. Yeah, it's kind of fresh. Yeah, yes, yes. But it's still good. And the seeds here, as I said. Yeah, it's you, a little browner yeah, you, than the sour sap. Mm -hmm. Direct. But you don't use the seeds otherwise, right? No, no, no. no. At you least for now. No. Somebody uses it, I guarantee you, though. You're going to hear yeah, something. Yeah, you can after a while. <laughs> Alright. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Alright, so. And it's good for nerves, too, you know. Yeah. Alright. In fact, that's what I'm going to ask you now. The benefit. The health benefit, as far as you yeah, know, Rasta. Yeah. What, what, what? You can, you have, you get a lot of different benefit, even for the man. Mm -hmm. The manly wood. Yeah. It's good for it, too. Oh, no. stamina? Yes. Okay. Yeah, make you stronger. Uh -huh. and all that. So good for that, good for men. Mm -hmm. Stamina? Uh -huh. yeah. What else? As far as you know? You, well, colon, clean your colon. Clean your too, colon. Same like sour sap. Uh -huh. Take cold from your system uh -huh. too. Uh -huh. Yeah. So clean you. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Good. So that's, that's, that's for me. And you, well, listen. Well, actually, actually, guys, I'm going to, I did a little bit research for you on it. And I'm going to share with my viewers and yourself. I know you, 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 you have this thing. Lock under lock and key, you know this stuff. Because like, actually, he's he's actually a roots man. Yeah. We're gonna talk about sure. we're gonna talk about how you can reach him, reach him in terms of his, his any of his root stuff, guys. Him, him, this man know him stuff, you know. Yeah, man. This man a, a veteran in the roots in, in the underground for nine days. Eh? Cook the roots, uh -huh. chop them up, chop uh -huh. them up, but uh -huh. I don't glue them green. Uh -huh. And then now I dry them a little. Uh -huh. Chain the roots, strong back, uh -huh. sassy perilla. Uh -huh. Chain him. You me don't use blood whisk because yeah. I know everybody want blood whisk. Yeah, yeah. Because sometimes some people have a little ailment and yeah. Yeah. blood whisk can I push up the pressure on okay, yeah. them. So I don't do directly unless I want want it. Yes, yes. And in, me introduce it to them. Yeah. But I mostly use like even guava root, uh -huh. but it's the red guava root uh -huh. that have the natural benefit from it too. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. And then when I boil it in my pot, uh -huh. and I use the young banana navel, you know uh -huh. the navel at the banana, uh -huh. the, the pink, the yellow part, uh -huh. not the yellow, the kind no, of brown. Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. And then now I use the inside of the heart, uh -huh. and cut up that uh -huh. very nice. Even Chinese, the, the uh -huh. heart of the uh -huh. banana. Yes, yes. And then I make roots from that, uh -huh. and bury it under the ground for nine days. Uh -huh. Dig it up back when you you can open it, man. If you open it, you <laughs> <laughs> all right. Why this? This is an ex, this is an experience. All right. Yeah. That's how you make your roots. Yes. All right. And then I take it to the street and uh, people buy it. Yes, man. Me. Miracles happen. Yeah. All right. Hold on, right there. Don't tell me too much yet. I'm gonna share, guys. I'm gonna share a little bit about this interesting fruit here, right? So we came. Remember, we came from Mountain Sap. Another another unusual fruit here. Something looking like something of a sauce up family. But we have, we have been introduced to a myriad of other stuff thanks to Rastaman Clyde. But I don't want to finish without telling you some of the health benefits because I did some background work on it. And let's share, share with you right now. Number one, the leaves can be used to make tea. We Rastaman mentioned that earlier. Um, and it's recommended to be consumed in the evening before retiring to bed because it has a relaxing and sedative effect that encourages sleep. So that's the leaf, similar to sour sap leaf. Sour sap, yeah, right, the same kind right, of thing. Yeah. Yeah, it's fever and headaches can also be treated with the leaves, intestinal parasites, coughs, including asthma and bronchitis, inflammation, diabetes, and hypertension have all been treated with this Mom, amazing yeah. fruit. Yes, the seeds, the bark, the leaves and roots, among other things. That's what I that, that's what we are learning for you. It's antiviral, antiparasitic, anti rheumatic, anti inflammatory, anti hypoglymic, anti hypoglymic activities have been discovered in many extracts around the world. It is also used to treat, de treat depression for pregnant women and infusion of leaves mm -hmm. has pain-relieving properties. Wow. 
and uh, we're learning we're learning too that compounds found most in the bark and leaves of the mountain sap have been shown to kill cancer cells. You mentioned that earlier, fire. Yes. You know what you're talking about, man. <laughs> 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 Fevers and head pain can be relieved using this plant. Leaves as well. And in Jamaican culture here, it believes that the fruit, when made in a drink, helps to helps with men, stamina and vitality. What's the man telling you already? <laughs> uh, what about the culinary uses? The yellow aromatic pulp. The yellow aromatic pulp can be eaten raw in deserts we're told although it is mostly commonly used to make juice its taste is inferior to that of the sour sap we spoke about that already and it can be it can it does it can get a bit slimy when when completely ripe like this one here <laughs> when completely ripe they are eaten fresh as a dessert or blended with ice cream or milk to form a drink when the seeds are still soft Immature fruits are collected and used as a vegetable in soups and other dishes. You hear that, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, man. So that's a mountain sap. We say Jamaican mountain sap, but it's not. It's not na native to Jamaica. It's it's, like it's native to it's native to Central America in, in general. So not just Jamaica uh, and the Caribbean, right? And and we've mentioned earlier that it is it is round typically and has a fragrant aroma. The, the scientific name for the scientist, experienced and aspiring scientist, the name of it, guys, is Anana Montana. Mm -hmm. Anana Montana, yeah. For those people who are purists in, in herbs, in fruits and these kind of things, that's what they're going to research. So if you want to research it further, this weird, unusual fruit, another one, thanks to Fireman Clive, you can actually go ahead and research it. Anana, Anana Montana. So yeah, this is not the only thing you do. You do you do all kind of juice. You mentioned yes, one of the green you, juice you, earlier. You know this? Yeah. Noni. Noni. Yes, man. Yeah. I use noni with huh. like pineapple mm -hmm. and guava and mm -hmm. make juice too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh. Very good. You, do, you, you put it on to, to drain still as well? Yeah, drain it too. You get the drain different. But for, for this, I use this with the fruit and blend it. Oh, blend it same ripe. time? Yeah, once oh. it's ripe. Uh -huh. And then I juice it with my cheesecloth. Ah. And strain. Oh, I see. I see. Yeah, man, I see a street, street, yeah. street cloth. And cheesecloth, you call it. Yeah, uh -huh. and then after me, you strain it too to make it sure, fine. All right. That means, All right, nice. You know, I like your little production era here. Yeah, I love your little production era here, man. I look like a pot and you look like a strain yeah, and everything. Yeah, man. Love it, love it. Rasta man, li li uh, life in the hills of Camrose. Yeah. Camrose. Yeah. All right, so yeah, man, I want, want to ask. So, people, right now, there are people out here, my viewers watching right now. I know some of you are interested right now in learning more about this man. His root stuff, his, his unique drinks, whether it's mountain sap, whether it's sour guava, sap. whether it's sour sap, whether it's noni, whatever it is, you and are I, I, cut you. I use sour sap uh -huh. juice with cane juice and I squeeze it in the skin. I don't take off the skin, show away. What is sour sap? The sour sap. Oh. Once it's ripe, yeah. I juice it with the skin uh -huh. and you get a nice flavor out of it and it's more stronger because uh -huh. you don't throw away nothing and uh -huh. more than the seed alone. Oh, look at the seed, man. <laughs> Almost 80 year old and look at you, man. <laughs> man firm and stern. <laughs> All right, good. So, anyway, I want people to be, be able to get, get a hold of you if they're interested. So, so, first of all, as we said, that we're looking, we were here for the mountain sap, um, but you do a lot more than mountain sap. If this people are interested in. It's green juice, too. Yeah, green juice. If people are here in Jamaica, I want to get want to reach you. Yeah. Where can they find you first? I'm right on the corner of Megamart uh -huh. on the left side of the road. Uh -huh. Going into Catching All. Uh -huh. That's where I'm at. All Every right. day except Saturday and Sunday. Alright, good. Good. So if you're in Jamaica and you're in and you want to find this man uh, to learn to buy some more of his, his fruits and stuff, he's 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 right there. Catching all Montego Bay right. area, all right? right at the roundabout. If somebody yeah. wants to talk to you, I want to learn some stuff from you, or I want to get some advice, or I want to want some coaching or something, yeah. and you know what I mean? I'm more about juices, natural juices and, and stuff, including mountain sap. Is there a phone number they can reach you? Yeah, my number is 791-4276. Mm -hmm. Seven my nine one. Is Clive, Raphael Clark. Is Clive, 791 Yeah. 4276 and we're in jamaica guys you add your 876 to that and there's a whatsapp number as well guys it's 876-779-3637 that's 
779-3637 number on screen and it's also in the description below all right i have a little bonus for you guys all right remember i told you that uh rastaman sell in town well i made a impromptu visit <laughs> to check him out and what you got here now so you're live on the job now yeah how are you have now this one is we call this Perlina ah. with oats, ah. pumpkin seed, and Irish mash. <laughs> All right. Right. All right, this good. is one. Uh -huh. This one is turmeric uh -huh. with pumpkin seed. Uh -huh. Straight turmeric and pumpkin seed. Oh, cool, cool. Yeah, and the milk inside of it is peanut. Okay. Because cool. I don't use condensed milk. Okay, and okay. What that one good for? This one is good for the prostate cancer. Okay. okay. For man and stuff. Okay. Yeah. Uh. And this one is Irish mash. Uh huh. With arrowroot. Uh. Pumpkin seed ah. and you have inside of it like um what do you say now? Peanut. Peanut, okay. Same way. Okay. And you have like thinking to and tambourine. Oh you have a lot of that? Yeah, oh, what, what one that one good for? This one is good for the manly wood. Okay, stamina. Yeah. Right. Alright. Yeah. Alright, but alright, so but remember though the one that we have in mind, you know. Mm. The original oh, oh, mountain sap. Mountain sap. All right, yeah, man. That's coming what. to you. <laughs> coming to you. All right, guys, get into the mountain sap. We have a Latin story yeah, here, you know. Yeah, yeah. All right. This one now is the mountain sap. You see, you have a black cork, different. Uh, oh, you have yes. a different cork for it. Yes, right. All right, good. This one is mountain sap, uh -huh. guava, uh -huh. and then you have some um. We call it now June plum in it too. June plum? Yes. Oh, you just mix one. it up? Yes. All right. Squeeze it so this it. is the, this is the one we're talking about, guys. Yes, today, and yeah. It, yeah, yeah, yes, this one here. And all the good benefits and the health benefits right, we're talking right. about. Yeah, right, yeah, yeah. So we're going to have a drink again, right? Same thing. <laughs> Why not? Why not? <laughs> all right. The Rasta man, make something for me. Uh, from uh, mountain sap, pumpkin, pumpkin seed. seed. You have melon skin. Melon skin. Melon skin. Yes, the man have everything. Yeah, very aggressive. Come on, too. <laughs> yeah, right. With the guava. Alright. Have a kind of slimy. Yeah, that's yeah. what you get but, from the mountain. But that's the mountain top. Yeah. But it tastes good. Yeah. It tastes good. Yeah. Oh, man. Big up yourself, man. <laughs> Alright, guys. Mountain top. Jamaican style. I have another, another surprise here for me, guys. You know and allow me to leave without this another one. Which one is this now? This one is the sorrel wine. Sorrel wine? It's about a year and a half old. Oh, yes, sir. Yeah. Sorrel, our local sorrel. Sorrel, local Jamaican uh, sorrel. Uh -huh. Okay. Fermented. Okay, Fermented. natural. Yes. Natural. All right, go on. <laughs> We're getting bonus from all sides here, guys. So it's not just mountain sap now we hear it. I kind of man, we have to do a part two, man. <laughs> guys, <laughs> hey, guys, guys give, me a, give me a. Give me a thumbs up if you think we should do a part two. This man has so much stuff here. <laughs> Give me a thumbs up or drop it in the comment right now. <laughs> Alright, so this is it. Sorry, one. Alright, nice, one. nice. Let's take a drink. Let's take a drink. What? Bad man. Bad man. Yes. Yes, that's a real wine, man. Yes, sorry, wine. For a minute. And we drunk it, not true. It might make you look good. Yeah, man, it like, tastes like alcohol. It tastes, yeah. but no, but no, nothing like that. No, I'm going to say Yeah. Say it's sorry with ginger. Uh -huh. And I'll put some ginger in but it. Nice, it's nice, it's nice, it's nice, it's nice, it's nice. Pick nice, nice, nice. no, no, right, up yourself, pick up yourself again, man. All right, bye bye. All right, cool, cool. The mountain sap, guys, courtesy of my brethren, Clive, Rootsman, Rastaman. Here, listen, before I say anything else, I want to tell you about another intriguing video. Another fruit that I did is called the Purple Gourd. If you haven't watched it as yet, you definitely should. There's a link in the description and it's linked in the card above. Check it out and I'll see you there. But before you go, I need you to give us some thumbs up, man. Big up, Sir, Sir Clive, and lots of learning. Lots of learning. I learned a lot, I'm sure you did as well. So if you appreciate that, give us some thumbs up and share this video. Share with someone, man. The more the merrier. And of course, you know, I love hearing from you. What do you make of this fruit? Have you seen it? Did you know about it before? If you use it, how do you use it? Share it in the comments below. And if there's another fruit that you know of that you want me to cover, share that as well. I would love to do another interesting Jamaican fruit. See you in the next video.